composer David Lang wrote simple song number three in the movie Youth. He sent director Paolo Sorrentino many versions as he put it together. He would write me back and he would say, Oh, David, I am crying a little and I need to cry a lot. Lang kept working until the piece was perfect. I was trying to avoid imagining myself in a completely damaging, horrible environment, and now I guess I have to go there. Most composers write once movies are completely finished. But since Youth's plot is based on a composer, Lang wrote first, and the movie was made around his score. All I had to go on was a very early draft of the script and all of my conversations with Paolo about these kind of philosophical ideas about the way music could work. The movie's main character, Michael Caine, wrote simple song number three when he was young. His performance of the song at an older age is the climax of the film. It had to be something that you would believe a young person could write when he was optimistic and full of love and happy and had a future. And it could also be something that was a little um, bittersweet and a little tragic of someone looking back at things that, um, that used to be that aren't anymore. The Academy left two scores nominated for Best Song out of the Oscar ceremony, including Simple Song Number 3. I understand it from a business point of view, but I also feel like it's a tremendous um, disappointment that these incredible singers, that Sumi Jo, one of the great um, sopranos of our day. I'm really sorry that the audience isn't going to get a chance to hear them. Lang teaches music at Yale University when he isn't writing it himself. Reporting from Los Angeles, Priscilla Liguori, WEBN.